Hello, my name is Dan Grimes. I am the director of Centenary Theatre Company's latest play, Little Women, which is on at the Brindley Theatre in Hong Kong from the 18th to the 22nd of September. The play, if you don't know it, is adapted from the novel by Louise May Alcott. It follows the lives of the four March sisters from their late teens to their late twenties. And it's a bit of a coming of age story really. You see a snapshot of their lives, how this family works, the changes that happen to them and around them within a, a space of around about ten years. Following all their trials and tribulations, arguments, love, friendships, what happens in their surroundings, how they interact with other people, when other people change, how it affects them as well. Learning how to be part of the world around them. Really heartwarming and quite sad at times. In fact, it takes you through a real emotional roller coaster. I think it's a story that even though it was set such a long time ago, it's something that audiences will still relate to now because families don't really change, the dynamics don't really change, the costumes and hair might be a little different, Definitely. but I think it is a very relatable story still. It's a firm favourite, so lots of people will already know the story, they'll already know the characters. Meg is growing up, she's thinking about all of the things that she thinks she should do as is her duty as the oldest sister to her family. I play Josephine March and don't really change much, just always want to be a boy. <laughs> I am Beth, I am the second youngest of the four sisters. I'm the sweet, caring, loving sister. Bit of a homemaker, likes to stay at home and help mum and look after all the sisters and make sure everyone's okay. Amy is the youngest of the four sisters. She is a very interesting character to play and she's probably the character that I identify most with because I'm the youngest of five. My character is gorgeous, she's Marmy and she's very kind, she's very loving. She absolutely adores her girls. There's no favouritism, she thinks they're all beautiful. She acknowledges their flaws and encourages them to always do better next time. It's an absolute joy to, to bring a bit of life to such a lovely character. Obviously all these characters kind of grow up together um, and they're all family and friends and really close-knit family and it's really nice that we kind of like managed to embody that ourselves as a cast. You, you do actually feel like a family so it's quite nice to get to act as well as well. Yeah. <laughs> We've had a really good time, it's been very emotional. Yeah. And really quickly um, we kind of developed a really good friendship and a really good bond between us. Rehearsals have been absolutely amazing and working with Dan as well as a director makes you feel comfortable at ease and gives you as much information as possible. And I've always said I learn so much from him. He is very explicit when he gives directions, he knows exactly what he wants you to do so you're not left in any doubt which gives you a lot of confidence. Um, he encourages great camaraderie, tremendous fun, and yeah, he's a joy to work with as a director. Rehearsals have been loads of fun. It's a big cast play, so that's always better because when you've got more people, it makes it more fun. I'm sure they would tell you that I have been awful because I don't let them get away with anything, but they've all worked really, really hard when they haven't been on a holiday. <laughs> People should come and see the show because it is a classic, 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 beautiful classic story. It's got some really heartwarming moments. Yeah, it really does. And I think there's at least one character that everybody yeah. can relate to. It's something in there for everyone, really. It'll be overall enriching for your soul. And, you know, working with Dan and uh, everyone on the team, it's just been fantastic. So much fun. The fantastic cast I'm working with, and the great director, of course, and everybody else who's worked so hard to put this production on. So please come along, tell all your friends and come and see a show that we'll be proud of. Buy tickets! Now! <laughs>